welcome everybody episode 3 of my heart journey in NHL 19 playing in round number 2 of the first season of legends uh, the first round didn't go great uh, I believe I don't even have the record in front of me just hold on one sec I was 3 2 and 1 so 3 wins two losses in a devastating loss in overtime that I have recorded if you miss it go check out episode number two because uh, I didn't end too good I was in overtime and I basically gave my opponent the, the win but it was a really really good game I did have a hat trick with McDavid in that game so hoping to uh, start off on a good note in round number two uh, I did play only one division game and I won that game I do have some new players in my lineup guys so we're gonna go to my lineup right now I have Gretzky, Lafleur, and McDavid, uh, Nathan McKinnon which um, as you saw at the beginning of the video I pulled in a free pre-order pack I was so happy so hyped to pull Nathan McKinnon looking at his stats the speed 93 acceleration and speed he has great stats for sh shooting and uh, deking as well so stoked to have one of the best centers in the league right now. Kovalchuk and Galchenyuk I bought off the market. I already have hat tricks with McDavid and Galchenyuk in this game. Henrik Zetterberg, Corey Perry, and Paul Stastny, and uh, just the pre-order guys. So Udon, Taze, and Teresenko. Udon is really, really fast for an 80 overall uh, pre-order card. 91 acceleration and 90 speed. So I'm really happy for that. Defense is looking uh, pretty good. It's been uh, starting pretty rough, but I have added some key players. We have Latang and Ghost, uh, Tyler Myers, which is huge, six foot eight, two hundred twenty nine pounds. He will destroy people. Ryan McDonough, Adrian O'Coin, uh, got at the beginning of the year as my pre order, uh, basically my starter legend, and Dmitry Orlov, and in goal with a shutout streak of 60 minutes Frederick Anderson well it's more than 60 minutes because I played three qualifier games for hut champs and my three opponents quit mid game so uh, Anderson I played four games with him I only gave in one goal and I accidentally put it in my own net sorry Anderson you still basically have a shutout streak going so let's get into a game see how long Anderson's shutout streak can go uh, because that goal came in a qualifier game so, so far between Division and Hut Champs, uh, Division and Competitive Season, let's see if we can keep it going, get into a game. Okay, so we found our opponent, the Ice Warriors. Feels good to be recording again, I haven't recorded anything since uh, last Saturday, I have been sick uh, all week, I had pretty much lost my voice, I had a really really bad cold, I had a uh, sore throat, and was coughing all day, so getting really really better almost back to normal today and my voice isn't 100% yet but good enough to commentate some chell guys so Gretzky against Gretzky off the face off unfortunately we lose Guy Lafleur, my favorite card to use in this game so far he's just so freaking quick look at that gets bumped off the puck almost gets it back Wayne Gretzky over Owen Guy Lafleur, that pass missed it was going right to Lafleur. that's pretty unfortunate all right Oh, what a clutch shave by Anderson there. Here's uh, Guy Lafleur. Oh, right around the defense. Come on, Lafleur. Let's go around. Let's go, Guy Lafleur. Le Demont Blanc. A Canadian Montreal, and it's one to nothing. Let's go. Oh, Kovalchuk. Right around the defense. Can we get in front? Oh, it was blocked. Alcina got a doorstep. Let's go. Nathan McKinnon in his competitive season debut hits a goal. Two to nothing. Let's go. Also, quick, uh, quickly, guys, I got a few more updates uh, for some content. I will be doing a franchise mode. I did do a poll on Twitter a few weeks ago. Just uh, when I wanted to do the franchise mode, I started losing my voice, bad timing, and I just thought it'd be best have my full voice just for the quality of it, being able to actually uh, speak. So I'm gonna be doing that. I'm gonna be doing a probably monthly highlights uh, video of all my best goals. So I do have. Um, Sub saved already, so just think it'd be fun, kind of like the plays of the month. And also, of course, this hut series where I'll be playing like all the competitive seasons and everything. And yeah, it's gonna be fine. Here's Connor McDavid. Can we get around his defense? We can't, but there is Guy Lafleur all alone. Nice stop by Hextall. Oh, and also, one more thing, guys. I will be uh, possibly doing an NHL recap series. So, this is my idea go over the past week in the NHL in real life 
Uh, just going over big trades, free agent signings, big performances, uh, notable uh, historic events, injuries. I thought it'd be kind of fun because I've seen some people on YouTube doing it for baseball, NFL, and I just feel like it would be fun to do it for NHL. It helped me stay up to date with everything that's going on in the league and help you guys. It'd be something to look forward to every week, possibly on the Sunday. So let me know what you guys think of that. I think it'd be fun. Well, Galchenyuk over to Kovalchuk. What a play. Kovalchuk to Galchenyuk. And what a goal. The two number 17s connect. Galchenyuk from Kovalchuk. Wow. Oh, no. Here's Parise all alone. And there is Anderson. Shutout streak is over. So... Uh, let's see, he gave up a goal, which was a goal I scored in my own end in a qualifier game, but my opponent quit halfway. So, for full games, he lasted the first game, so 60 minutes plus an extra 20 plus an extra 10, so about 90 minutes of uh, shutout streak. So, I had a boy, Freddie Anderson. What a great start to his career with me in 2019 hot. And my opponent's going to go down. Dimitri Orlov with a hit. Wow, this was part of their game plan. he's not he the biggest guy, but he's tough. Come on, I've got it over Christopher Letang in front. How did that not go in? What happened there? It was like, had the goal line somehow. Wow, so we got Letang over to Wayne Gretzky around Dynako. Oh, and Wayne Gretzky's going to have a penalty shot, I think. No, yes, he is. All right, Wayne Gretzky, the great one on a penalty shot. Can we make it count? Going on Ron Hextall. Forehand, backhand, and we get a goal. Wayne Gretzky on the penalty shot. Oh, that was a nice goal. Wayne Gretzky gets the goal for him. Cuts the lead to two. Wow. Four to two game. And the shots are 22 to seven, I believe, now. Wow. I don't know if you guys noticed this. When he iced the puck in NHL 19, Doc Emmerich says... The best part of the cake, the worst part of hockey, icing. Thought that was funny. Orlov, what a play. And a one-timer, basically automatically. I didn't even hit the shooting button. That was kind of funny. Gretzky, come on, Lafleur. Let's get a goal here. Oh, spin around around him. Can we go in front? De La Fla gets absolutely destroyed, but that was a great scoring opportunity. Hawker stop. Taze, over to Tarasenko, and he hit the post with a shot. Close it out, see if we can get another goal. Over to McDonough. Oh, he tries a one-hander, but <laughs> Hexall says no. We do get the win in round two of this competitive season, game number one. Let's look at the stats. So, of course, we win 4-2. 32-8 the shots. Wow, what a great game. Let's get the three stars. Galchenyuk, a goal and assist. Gretzky, a goal and assist. And Kovalchuk, two assists. Ohio Hockey Club now I was recording a game between the first one in this video and the game here Unfortunately for some reason the audio cut off uh, halfway and only got about half of the audio. I did lose that game so uh, Here in our third qualifier game, but not qualifier preliminary games for this competitive season So it uh, looks like it's gonna be a good game. He's got uh, Hall and Gretzky on the first line. I'm not sure who else so here we go, we got Ghosts, went on the wing, and a nice shot that is stopped by his goaltender. I wonder who he has in net. Over to Wayne Gretzky, big clapper. Oh, and he has Sergei Bobrovsky in the net. And I would have guessed that given he's a Blue Jackets fan for sure. The Blue Jacket logo and jersey. He's got Bob, one of the better goaltenders in the league. It's going to be hard to beat. On McDonough, oh, nice stop by Bobrovsky. Oh, and he gives me the puck in front. Nathan McKinnon once again gets a goal for me. He has been huge since I pulled him in the pack uh, last Monday. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Tyler Myers over to Alex Galchenyuk. And he's tripped. That's a penalty shot for Chucky. All right. The newest member of the Arizona Coyotes. Provorov trips him. Let's see if we can go get a goal here. On Bobrovsky, backhand, let's go, Alex Galchenyuk, and it's 2 to nothing. Oh, what a hit. Who is that? Connor McDavid laying the body, wow. McDavid right around his defense, backhand, oh man, if McDavid scored there, that would have been insane. Is that Shea Weber he's got there, number six? Pretty big guy for sure. Oh, let's go, Connor McDavid all alone, come on, one-hander. 
Oh, nice stop by Bobrovsky. That was that would have been sick by McDavid there with Shea Weber on his back. Oh, Wayne Gretzky with the spinorama right around him. Still has it from the corner. Over. Oh, what a goal. Wayne Gretzky. Amazing. Wow. Oh, what a play, what a play by Tyler Myers sir, at defense. Over to Kovalchuk and that was filthy. Let's go guys, four to nothing. Oh, Fluff, oh, Gretzky is going with the one-hander. Oh, Wayne Gretzky with two absolutely nasty goals in this game. The one-hander on Sergei Barossi and it's five to two. Loving this card, guys. Gretzky and Lafleur hands down have been the two best cards I've used this year. Wow. McKinnon would be a close uh, third there. Oh, come on, Galchenyuk. Look at that speed. Over, oh, I tried to get it to left side, it wouldn't go. And we are walking away with the second win of round two of this competitive season. So we are two and one at the moment. See where ranking is after these uh, three games. So really solid game for this one. So we got the stats, 24-17 the shots, 5-2 to two the goals. Time and attack uh, almost doubled. Wayne Gretzky, two goals. Galchenyuk, a goal and an assist. And Kovalchuk with a goal. All right, so let's look at the team leaders right now. So Guy Lafleur leading the way, 16 games played with 16 points. McKinnon, 15 points in only 10 games. Galchenyuk, 13 points. Kresge, he's been uh, heating up as of late. Uh, only four goals and three assists, but uh, two goals in that last game, of course. Uh, Guy Lafleur, look at that, 12 goals. So these cards actually uh, really, really good. So our overall record is 11, 4, and 1 at the moment and that's gonna be it for the video thanks for watching guys leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe if you're new and uh yeah thanks for watching as always have a great day